Hi guys, I just want to update you of my smooth hydrangeas. Um, I have three here. Um, what they look like uh, in midsummer. So this one is the. But I don't cut. I don't deadhead them because I like it that way. This one is um, mini vet invincible mini vet And then our incredible and then Limetta or Limetta, Invincible Limetta. You know, um, this is what I'm telling you. Now it looks so pretty, right? Before the first three years of this, it looks so ugly or like um in early summer. Like it looks so burnt but just like like, like this but all like all the flower it's the entire flower but this time no not anymore because i um i have more shades here that's why i'm saying that if you have invincible ameta it's really beautiful but you have to put it in a more shaded area like for real no afternoon sun and then i will show you the my incredible have babies this is incredible look it's coming from there i don't even know from roots i this is incredible i'm so sure it's incredible because i already have babies that i transplanted i have lots there is two more here uh, three more there so by um late winter i can separate them if i want to but i think these three will stay there so it's gonna be more beautiful here it's gonna be more bushy around this area but these two it's gonna block our um, filter here so these two um next late winter i'm going to transplant them in the backyard 